Hey everyone, it's Sue here. I've been following along with Cindy Utter, who has a Facebook group called I Am. And um, it's really, it's very inspirational and makes you kind of dig in deep, like uh, look inside yourself, so to speak. And um, this week, she what did her page on I am an artist. So I wanted it, my page to be very colorful. And I think I have accomplished that. <laughs> um, I started with a napkin in the background that has numbers on it. Then I took a piece of um, text, you know, a page from a book that I had already had color on it and some stamping on it. And I tore it into three and I put a piece here a piece in the middle and a piece on the side and you can see it over here right like that orange that's that's the page um, <clears throat> I also went and took let's see these three colors of this I guess it's art company it's from Michaels and it's paste that's already colored so I pulled in those three colors using this stencil and this is one of the stencils that I got from um, Housewares on Etsy. It's H-O-W-S-E-W-E-A-R-S. -E -E she has the best stencils ever. Um, so I took those pastes and I did half and half with the flowers and um, gave it a good dry. I went and added some uh, of this plastic mesh which is really cool because when you go to dry it with the heat tool, it, it melts and it gives it such cool texture. I love it. Love, love, love. Um, let's see, what else did I do? So I added some dilution spray and I used um, lemon zest and uh, London blue. What I did was I took this, which I guess is a, I guess it's a trivet, right, for the kitchen. I don't know what it is. What is this used for? I have no idea. But anyways, it's meant, I guess, for the kitchen. And so I just placed it around in a few spots, and I sprayed, um, like I said, these two colors. The blue came out really uh, vibrant and very clear, but the yellow kind of got a little bit lost, but that's okay. I can still see the yellow. Then I went ahead and I pulled some sayings from a, um, a sticker sheet that I have. Love the art that's inside you. Find your inner artist. Make a beautiful mess. To the artist, everything is possible. And for the love of art. I thought those were pretty cool considering that this week's prompt is I am an artist. So what I wanted to do was I did put a little piece of washi down here that I had left over, but I really don't like having one of something on a page bothers me. <laughs> so I'm just taking the washi which I got at Michael's and I'm just going to put a little bit more on just because just because so I think I'm going to put a little piece up here. And I think I'm going to put a little piece over here as well. And, yeah, that's what I want to do. Okay, so I have that. At the last piece, I want to work with this Posca paint pen. Um, I would tell you the color of it, but it's all in Japanese. I cannot read it. It is obviously blue, but I don't think there's one word on here that is in English. So, I can't tell you the color. Um, all I wanted to do was go around with the blue around the words, or the, around the sayings. And, I mean, I know you all know this, but, you know, as it's wet, you just gently rub with your finger. And it gives it that really nice, smeared, artsy look, right, that we all love. And I like it when it gets a little bit onto the the word or the saying, the phrase. 
that you're working with. And to me, uh, I don't know, the messier, the more I like it. So, you know, I'm, I'm not too neat with this. Um, and yeah, what it does is obviously it just makes the the phrases pop just a little bit more. I mean, you can see the difference that with these, uh, these phrases pop a little bit more than these two down here, right? Sorry if I'm moving my, my iPad. I film with my iPad and it's on a, um, it's on a tripod, but the tripod is on my table. So if I move too fast or whatever, it just shakes the whole thing. So I'm sorry about that. So I'm thinking that that's it as far as that goes. Um, gosh, you know what? I'm thinking it's pretty much done. What I think I'll do is just put a few little curly cues, three to be exact, because I just, you know, this thing of threes, right, in my head. Um, and I think I'm going to call this one quits. I am done. So this is page 10 for the I Am Facebook page. And um, I'll leave a link below to the Facebook group if you would like to join. And it's a small group. It's a new group. It's small. Um, it's very personal. Uh, I, I like it a lot. And Cindy does videos every week of her pages and she'll sit and she'll talk and as she's talking and working I'm talking and working so as she was working on her page 10 I got oh my goodness at least halfway through with this particular page so thank you Cindy and if anybody has any questions let me know and please subscribe I would love it and um and I'll be back. Okay, have a great day, everybody. Bye-bye.